What's up guys, what's going on? Sorry, I'm being on video. Today we are back in our solo seven days to die. Because I just want oh ooh, ooh, I think we should go for that. Uh it's about to be safe enough to go for that, so just keep that in mind. Go over there. Uh, after this, we do want to head home. It's probably gonna be a good idea, unless we want to do our loop to loop tactic to possibly get our bag, because this might be one of the final episodes of this season, this solo season. Because I just want to go ahead and make a little update video reassuring you guys that seven days still exists, and I did not quit it, contrary to quite popular belief for some reason. I uh, don't worry. I just want to go ahead and reassure you guys that it is continuing and it is going. To, are these guys running? Okay, no, good. Uh, that it is going to continue. It's just that we've been kind of putting off just because mainly it's been kind of hard to schedule stuff, and a lot of us have actually been kind of with anticipation of Alpha 10 and what Alpha 10 is supposed to entail. A lot of us have been kind of. We don't want to play Alpha 9 and because we're really excited for Alpha 10 and. That's exactly why, really, I haven't been playing it either. Where the fuck did they... Oh, is that... Is that it? I... I guess that's it. Seems to be on a really tall mountain. Unless it's on, like, top of it. No, it's falling down. Ah, huh. alright, I guess we'll go for this one. <laughs> Piece of candy. But, so I just want to go ahead and reassure you guys that... I'm going to continue doing seven days. I would not quit doing this, just that... I've mainly been waiting for the Alpha 10 update, and this is probably going to be the quote-unquote finale of uh, this season. And it's still going to continue as a game, though. It, it, of course it will. You know, I love this game. I've been playing this game for over a year at this point, and it's still, it's still an awesome game. The fact that they're updating it, just that I do want to wait for Alpha 10. And I, did I feel like it's been a very good chunk of time since I've jumped in, so I thought I might as well explain myself, kind of kind of talk about why certain things yada yada and that's exactly what I'm trying to do I'm just gonna leave that now we head to our bag it's really what I want to do uh, there should be a road we should be able to circle around to if we head east I think that's what we need to do no clue what happened to that other supply drop I did learn how to make the enforcer on the off chance we find all four parts within the next 20 minutes but I do just want to reassure you guys that it's going to continue and uh, not to worry. You know, if you, if you don't, if it's all you watch on the channel, well, don't worry. You know, it's going to be back. We were just mainly waiting for Alpha 10, which we still are. And hopefully, if all goes well, it should be releasing this weekend. So that means well, a couple days from now, uh, maybe a day, maybe the day this video is posted, maybe a, a day after. I don't know, but Alpha 10 is extremely close to dropping right now. So I just want to kind of update you guys on the status of that. Okay, I thought the sun was setting for a second. I'm like, oh god. Mistakes have just been made. Yeah, so that's just kind of situation with that. And I did want to remind you about that. And I think I've been going on in circles, so I'm just going to try to sum this up relatively well. Uh, we... We just kind of stopped playing Alpha 9 because Alpha 10 was rumored to be coming out soon. Now it's finally going to be coming out, so we're going to be hopping back into that in case that is like one of your favorite series as ever. Because it's actually really fun to record. And when Alpha 10 happens, hopefully we convince Taco never to fucking cheat again. Uh, is this the road? The road seems like... The, the textures seem off in the distance. I don't know. Do you see that? It seems odd, to say the least. Doesn't seem like a road texture, but... Whatever. Anyways, we're hopefully gonna convince Taco not to cheat because that kind of that kind of played a big effect in how the last series played out, and we kind of we definitely want to keep it legit this time because people were getting mad at Taco, and by people I mean mainly we were ourselves because he was kind of killing the spirit of the game. So hopefully he doesn't freaking cheat this time. We'll we'll do our best to convince him, and by that I mean if he cheats, he's probably uh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you catch my drift. Anyways, no, I'll probably be fine. He, he won't cheat if we tell him not to. And again, I, I don't know. He's he's a pretty resistant. He's a pretty rebellious person. I know. I've had experience with him for a very long time. Anyways, like I was saying, moral of the story, Alpha 9 we played for a lot. We wanted to wait for Alpha 10, so we kind of stopped playing it and also scheduling conflicts. But now that Alpha 10 is about to release... We're gonna be hopping back, and for all of those of you who love Alf, who love Seven Days, 
don't worry, because Alpha 10 actually is going to bring a lot of stuff to the table, and mainly, one of the things that I was reading from the developer's blog is apparently, supposedly proposed by the developers, is that it's going to make the zombies a lot more difficult when it comes to defending your base. Now, that, that doesn't mean that zombies themselves are getting harder or tougher, but actually what they're trying to do is make zombies smarter. Uh, hopefully that makes enough sense. Also, we have pistol ammo, right? Yeah, we can kill those freaking bees now. Maybe we'll stand a little bit of a chance. Do we have our hunting rifle? I thought we had a hunting rifle too. No? Oh, I could have sworn we did. Motherfucker, I hear that. Oh my god. We gotta go smack that thing down. Anyways, apparently that is one of the things, one of the big things coming in Alpha 10, along with like super sexy fires, probably some other things, but mainly zombies are gonna, it, we're gonna have to definitely, there'll be less, less time for goofing off like we were doing before, and we're gonna have to focus quite a bit on actually, uh, there we, oh my god, just one shot that dog, amazing, uh, we're, we're definitely gonna have to kind of stay focused on keeping the base afloat, because apparently, Zombies get tougher, there's like an entire heat map system where uh, the more you do stuff in an area, like if you constantly have your forge on, it generates heat on this map, and what this heat does is it, okay, this bee's pissing me off, what this heat does is it ends up actually, I, I don't know how to explain that well, it ends up, if an area gets hot enough, it might summon hordes to that area. No, oh, there we go, got him, he stung me. Get that freaking honey. Might as well eat that up. And then what happens is that heat map will actually have a bit of a it will it will definitely affect you in the way that it will summon zombies to your area. Which is actually absolutely amazing that it's gonna be god damn it. Why are there so many bees? There needs to be a way to exterminate the beehives because I hate bees. In real life Oh no, I messed it up. I scared him off. Oh he knows. He's he's running away. He knows what I'm about to do to him. Luckily we have plenty of daytime, so as long as we can eliminate the dogs and the bees, we should be absolutely fine. Yeah, no birds and bees this time. I'm talking about dogs and bees. Not gonna work too well. I don't know if that guy's gonna screw off or what. We'll just keep running down this way, losing frames along the way. Having a fantastic adventure. Ah, God damn it. I think anything's not giving up. Anyways, like I was saying, that is kind of what it's going to bring, is that zombies are going to be smarter when attacking your base. They'll actually kind of definitely be more capable of breaking in. It's going to require a lot more effort on our side to make sure that we don't die. So, it's going to definitely involve a bit more challenge. It's going to involve us actually having to, like, survive and focus more. And, oh my god, I'm down like 20 frames in this city. This is awful. Where's that be? I, I, oh, there it is. You motherfucker. Dropping my frames so I can't hit you? That's sneaky. It's very, very sneaky. Ugh. I wish bees would just screw off. I mean, in real life, I guess bees... Bees are pretty cool dudes in real life. Wasps are absolute assholes. I'm not sure. Apparently those are wasps slash hornets. But I don't think wasps slash hornets make honey. So that's a bit of an inaccuracy there, so I just call it motherfucker. I mean, I think the old bee kind of screwed off, but now we have this bee. God damn it. This is shenanigans. There we go. No! Oh! Dogs, dogs, dogs. There we go. At least we can one-hit the dogs. That's one thing we have going for us. Oh, man. Oh, man. Gotta time this well. Okay, okay. We got, we got rid of the dogs. We still have absolutely no stamina. Oh, my God. What is going on right now? Behind us is clear. Okay. I, I, I have no frames whatsoever to speak of right now. Oh my god, I'm dropping, I'm dipping, I'm dipping. What is going on? I hear like disturbing, okay. We got the dog, we gotta take care of the dog. I'll just, just, there we go, dog down, dog down. Got a couple more bees. Okay, a lot more bees. Holy shit. It's like they're guarding my bag. This is horrifying. Alright, Toro, motherfucker. There we go, got him batter up. Home run. No, no, I missed. There you go, home run on him. Uh, I have some sort of pill effect on me, and I'm not sure what that is. 
Is that another hornet? This is ridiculous. This is legitimately ridiculous at this point. Like, you've got to be joking me. I missed. Come at me. Come at me. Toro. Toro, I know you're not a bull, but whatever. You're charging like a bull, and you're dead like one, too. Even though that's not that great of a simile. Still, oh my god, my sledgehammer's about to be gone. How'd she get a hit in on me? God damn it, alright. This is going terrible. Well, we have the crossbow and a bunch of ammo for... Oh, I forgot! The crossbow. Nope, missed him. Gotta learn how to aim the damn thing. For the most part, it's a one shot headshot. So, I mean, okay, well, let's run to our area where our shit is. And we're gonna defend this, and hopefully, we can end the season with everything intact. That would be a fantastic goal of just reclaiming our shit we've been trying to reclaim for quite literally half the goddamned season. Okay, there's bag number one. Are we safe right now? We're undetected, supposedly. Supposed, not so supposedly anymore. Scared of all, oh my god, is that a freaking, is he a police officer? I'm trying to protect the area here. Can I go for the YOLO shot? Oh, well, I YOLO'd it, didn't really work out that well though. Oh, hit her. God damn, you gotta get a headshot with these, otherwise they're not too effective. That freaking police officer. Nope. Let it too much. I hear that beat coming up behind me, actually. Did I get the... Oh, I got a hit in on him, I think. Oh, shit. He's running. He's running. Okay, he blew up. No biggie. No biggie. He's got the stupid B. Hey! Sniped him. Oh, my God. Okay, you know what? This is kind of... It's buffing out. Now that we have a crossbow, a decent ammo for it, we can, we can kind of hold our own. Oh, my God. That's a lot of freaking zombies. Also, okay. Just get what we can here. Uh, uh, shit, we gotta drop. Okay, taking that back. Uh, I'll take the honey, I guess. Take, the, take our water. Might as well. Concrete block, no clue where that came from. Ammo, oh my god, yes, yes, yes. Screw the blood rockets, we have ammo. That hasn't happened in a very long time. Uh, screw the jars, screw all these... Actually, that's a shotgun part. We might... We, we probably want to keep the shotgun. It's made of wood, though. I think we can just kind of... I don't know. Coal ore? Eh. We, we, why do we have so much stuff? God damn it. Okay. Eh, yeah, eh, eh. Oh, son of a bitch. This is actually... Screw the flowers. Uh, I think we can craft this down into lead. Yeah, there we go. Saving up some room there. Metal strips. Screw the metal strips. Actually, so no, 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 no. Do not screw the metal strips. Let us screw that. Repair this as much as possible, first off. Gotta be very efficient. V oh my god! That repaired it so much. Thank you. Gotta be very efficient with our goods right now, though. To try and make as much room as possible for the real good stuff. First things first, let's kind of grab the clothes. Clothes are going to be good because we can actually put them on ourselves. Offer a bit of protection, <laughs> really not that much, but hey, it's something. Got a little bit of food. Getting kind of hungry. All right, that's good. That's good. Backpack's still going to be down here, but whatever. Yeah, uh, shotgun shells. Oh, might as well grab that. Got some more chicken. Um, stack those shotgun shells. Good band-aids. Screw this poopy band-aids. Ten millimeter bullets that are never used. Bunch of painkillers. Scrap iron, got some ooh, coffee, coffee. We definitely want some coffee. Uh, it's honey. It's honey is so good. Uh, screw, the gla eh, screw the glass jars. Screw the can. We already have a crossbow. We have the auger and a pickaxe. We have a full fire axe. We, have, we don't have a repair tool. Screw that, I guess. We don't really need that. We have the sledgehammer now. And seven antibiotics. We probably want those. All right, now... Uh, two gunpowder, not worth it. The struggle of getting our other bag. I don't. I think we can do this. I'm actually very confident. We've matured as Seven Days to Die players, and uh, we've definitely learned a valuable lesson. Of crossbow is one of the most essential things in your life, and get a good melee weapon. Also, learn how to kite. Kiting zombies is very useful. I think there's a good chunk of zombies somewhere because my frames started to dip and that usually indicates a bit of a mob of zombies oh god let's search this 
Why do why do I only have like parts? No, I had more shit than that on me. Didn't I? Well, any shotgun parts? Pump shotgun stock. We definitely want that. Uh, shotgun pump. Shotgun short barrel. I could care less about. And I mean, we already have our hunting rifle, so I think we are good for the most part. We have a couple of very shitty, but nonetheless, a couple of guns. Just organize this a little bit. I think that's good organization there. Crossbow first, then our guns, then our sledgehammer. I hear that thing coming for us. Sun is still rising. Oh my god, there's more. Alright, this is the part where we just start booking it home. We're done with the city. We're done with this shit. So we're gonna try to try our best to get home and maybe just maybe we'll finally be reunited with all of our shit. Or we might get stuck in this shithole of a town again. Or we could try heading south. Actually, I'm kind of tempted to head south and see what's down there. I mean, there's not much at home. It's really just kind of a ragtag church, but at the same time, yeah, I think we're going to be heading home. It's really our best escape from these evil people. <sighs> but now that we do have all of our stuff... And again, do we want to go in? We do have an auger now, so I'm getting a bit greedy here. Do we want to go ahead and possibly, maybe, let's drink some coffee, hit up a police station or something of the sorts. Oh my god, I forgot how loud that is. Yeah, 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 I'm, I'm thinking that's a, I'm thinking that's a yes, we do want to hit up a police station. Maybe this will have something, if not, we'll, we'll head home. We'll head home, let's not get too greedy. <sighs> oh god, got this asshole. Gotta sidestep that. He gives no shits. Come on, just headshot you. There you go, he's done for. Doggy. Oh god, this is this is where I messed up last time. This is where I messed up last Okay, let's just calm it down. Whip out the sledgehammer. Sledgehammer's whipped. <sighs> Dog's down. Frames are as well. Multiple things. Uh, my god, bees are so annoying. They're not even challenging. They're just stupid. I really hate them with a passion. They're awful. There you go. Oh my god, is that another one? Really? What? Did I just get a bloodshot on that? Oh my god. I'm gonna like back up into a zombie. Not sure I want to do that. Okay, we'll finish him off with a pistol then. Because I think... Oh no, I hear it throw up. I hear it throw up. Okay. Okay, okay. This is not good. However, the coffee is amazing. Our stamina is not going down at all. Okay, where are you, Bumblebee? Sick of your shit. There you go. Down for the counts. Alright, let's clear out these zombies. And maybe, just maybe, we can check out this place. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, God, I'm hitting you in the head. You should be dead from this. There we go. I'm aiming a bit too low, apparently. Stupid hitbox for melee weapons is very weird. Did I just hear someone throw up? Oh, it's that guy. Yeah, okay, we'll take care of him in a second. He's not. Okay, sidestep that. Oh, ew, ew, ew. He threw up on his friend. Ah, <sighs> god damn it. Okay, you know what? I'd say for now we just run away. Very quick. Yes, yes, I like that plan. Just run away and we'll possibly try to return. Yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking that's the best course of action, but hopefully you guys did enjoy me jumping back into seven days once again. Uh, if the Alpha 10 update doesn't release, I'll probably hop back in and record Un Mas episode. Uh, and maybe just kind of keep it going until Alpha 10 comes out, because I've definitely been craving it. And I do want to regain my expertise and be ready to be amazing at Alpha 10. I missed that shot, God damn it! Come on, Zambi lady. There you go. She's down. Sham sandwiches? Sham sandwiches. Too bad I'm not that desperate. Uh, forgot. It's really... Yeah, not gonna mess with that. I guess we'll just kind of leave it off over here in the fields of radiation and shitville. For lack of better words. Oh. Got another lady. See ya. 
Anyways, that was going to do it for me. So like I said, Alpha 10 coming out soon. Going to be re-kicking off the multiplayer again with that. Probably continue the single player as well. And it's going to be a fantastic time. Hopefully you guys are excited for it. I'm very excited. And that is going to do it for me for now though. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. As always, if you did, be sure to like and subscribe. Sign Signing out. Love you guys. See ya.